What's up guys? I uh, just wanted to give you a walk around on the car. Um, I'm going to kind of talk about some of the stuff that I have done to it um, so far. This is kind of, in a way, the first set of videos that I'm recording f through um, the process of me having this car and some of the modifications that I've done to it. So um, in other videos, I'll talk more about that stuff, but uh, let's get this rolling here. Uh, wheels, we've got the N-Key T6S. I uh, have these super wrapped. Um, it's the spray on, kind of like a plastic dip type deal. Uh, it's a lot more like paint though, uh, a lot more slick and doesn't uh, stuff doesn't stick to it as bad. I like it a lot. This is their bronze color. Uh, I got a few vinyl stickers on there, uh, just kind of a style thing. And then uh, they're wrapped in the Continental Extreme Contact. DWS and then they are 17 by 8 uh, that's uh, just a kind of a lip top one motorsports they're split so there's kind of one here and then one here um, I got this lip right here on eBay I uh, painted it myself as it you can see there probably uh, hopefully it's chipped pretty bad. Um, I get a lot of rock chips in the front of this car, unfortunately. So, um, but it's uh, I was able to match it up pretty well for the most part. Uh, this is plastic dip right here. Underneath the car, exhaust-wise, we've got a 1320 race header with the high flow cat. I'm using the high flow cat right now, uh, and then behind it is the. NVIDIA Q300, which I did have the Yonaka catback previously, um, and I'll probably make a separate video for that and tell you guys all about the exhaust. This is just a wrap that I put on there. And then under the hood, a few things under here. Under the hood, we've got the K-Tune three-inch uh, short ram, which I like a lot. Um, this is actually the it's the second short ram that I've gotten, um, and I'll make a video about some of those. Maybe uh, I had a Weapon R before, and I actually had that in two different setups. Modified it slightly for the second setup. Uh, basically trying to get it away from this area back here. Um, I did wrap the header. You guys can't really see it, but I did wrap that up. Um, valve cover's painted. And then I do have the TSX camshafts installed in there. Um, I was going to go with some RDX injectors. I had them in the car and I had some issues with it running super lean. So I think there may be some issues. I did, I did buy them used, so um, probably my fault there. I do have a guy that's going to flow test them, and then uh, if they're clogged up, he's going to clean them out for me. So we'll see how it goes after that. I do have some plans to get this thing tuned here pretty soon. Uh, the majority of these modifications are pretty new. Uh, the intake, the camshafts, uh, and the full exhaust was all done in the last month. So... Um, I'll be keeping you guys updated on how that goes, what kind of horsepower it's making and all that good stuff. So thanks for watching.